Whoa, calm down, Jamal. Step, bro. <laughs> oh! Fuck you, stupid episode. Well, I guess I don't know what number episode this is. But it's episode three of the new season. One and two have gone spectacularly. Somehow we are in 82 overall, and we're three episodes in. I think we're due for a loss if I, if I was a gambling man, which I am. Welcome back to Wheel of Up, baby! Getting right into today's episode. The wheel is spinning. We're looking hot. We're 3 and 0 oh for. Whatever reason, ooh, we're gonna get an after the fact challenge right here. So I get 50K per two point conversion that I convert in today's game, but I can only get that player obviously if I win. So three touchdowns, three two point conversions, and I win 150K on one player. Pretty self-explanatory, but it doesn't help us right now. Now before this second wheel spin, let's take a look at the team because we gotta think about this. So who could be upgraded right now? Kadarius Tony for sure. Jacob Johnson, we saw last episode. Yes, give me someone else, please. Left guard, center, right guard, and then left tackle and right tackle are not as good as they could be, but they're good for now. Need a backup tight end because they literally sub in like these random offensive linemen if you don't. Devontae Adams got to get that man some touchdowns. It's been a little bit more difficult than I'd like to admit. I've had these really good episodes, but I've only gotten him one touchdown. Owe and Devin White, amazing. You two need to get out. You two need to go. Just gone. Isaiah Simmons, God. Ted Hendricks, God. Ramsey's actually getting like low-key a tiny bit outdated. I need a new Ramsey card. Milk Mers could be upgraded in all of these guys, obviously. So at least my mind is in the right spot. I'm still going to somehow find a way to just pick something stupid here our wheel spin is oh my god that is huge five times store packs this is gonna get some of them bronzes out of there bro although the only packs in the store is elite packs or bonos this is 186 bonos 180 plus elite and this guarantees an 85 plus elite let's go five yeah five elite packs and just hope that we get a really nasty pull Chandler jones i mean it's actually pretty good right now because i got tony fields in there walter payton's power up okay and cody white here Elite pack number two. Nope. Nope. Ladanian Thomas. Is that my elite? No. This was an L. Elite pack three. Come on, baby. There's a 90 lurking in here, right? Joe Hayden, dude. N Actually, that's a good position, though. All right. Elite pack four. Come on, baby. Heavyweight. A heavyweight. A center and right guard. That's actually huge. I knew that one was going to be good. All right. Our final elite pack. Keenan Allen. Oh, team of the week player. It's ah, 85 Eckler. Top. We did get some good upgrades today, though, for sure. Also, Quentin Spain has an insane pack of punch to 96 Quentin Spain. So we'll keep that in mind. And then uh, Taylor Moten, the right tackle, can actually play left guard. Anybody that can go in for Jacob Johnson. I am going to put us in Eckler here because everyone's going to scum kick me and I don't want to fumble. Left outside linebacker, Chandler. Chandler Jones. And our other middle linebacker, I think, could be Patrick Queen. I think that's who I pulled. And Louder Milkers is gonna come out too. Can you fucking believe that? We're in the 88 overall. We literally could play with anybody already. Let's just get another Super Bowl, I guess. Let's just go get it. Challenge wheel spinning and my game is loading up. I'm never supposed to do that because now I'm gonna see the top three of my challenge wheel at the same time. There's my top three. His name is Snag God. That actually literally horrifies me. Darrell Revis, Akeem Talib, Richard Sherman, Buccaneers theme team. My challenge wheel is two touchdowns, less than five yards. I have completed this the last time I got it. Not easy. So I need one player needs to have two TDs, but less than five total yards. I guess it could be Jacob Johnson on a fullback dive, right? Play action. Oh, that left side is so open. Ah! Probably something similar. Go get him, go get him, go get him. Uh-oh. Left side crosser is there. Back across the middle is there. Big hit! gonna go with a little handoff and finally we are gonna get him for some uh, negative yardage second and goal he's gonna probably scramble left again with Vic right side's open oh that's not open oh the fail oh way oh that would have been massive I'm surprised he threw that it's third and goal oh get there Hendrix Let's go! No, he's out of bounds. No! Two picks. Two picks lost. All right, I'm happy though. Three to zero, I'm happy. All right, well, you're about to see Austin Eckler as a lead blocker for the first time ever. And he made, he made a really solid block, actually. Eight yards for Jonathan Taylor on his first carry. I'm gonna try and get his user a little confused here. What the fuck? How is that even possible? How can you get through that fast? I don't know. 
Wow, he stayed in bounds. What a play. Wide open is Waller on the playmaker. He does elude the first tackler. We're gonna let that man go out of bounds. Great blocking, boys. Good cut. Oh, I thought that was gonna be a perfect cutback. It was not. I'm gonna get really unorthodox here. I'm going slip screen. Actually, no, I'm going inside zone. Third and five, this is there. Yes, sir. Yes, sir, Jonathan Taylor. I love Jukebox too. Uh, I'm gonna look for Darren Waller. Ziggrats are pretty good this year. What the fuck? Hey, what a play call. We are going deep in the playbook right now. I back I saw to Jonathan Taylor. Eckler Lee blocking. Get there. Oh no. I'm I showing again. I run commits. Jonathan Taylor. Built different. You think he expects one more ISO? I doubt it. No way he run commits again though. Wow. He ran commit again. I'm gonna pass and he's gonna run commit one more time. Come on, do it again, do it again, do it again. Oh, I was praying, bro. Hey! Oh, no. Oh, wait, you're Austin Eckler. <laughs> Darn it. Okay, I can't complete the challenge with Adams anymore, but at least I know Adams is a touchdown on this throw. I'm gonna roll out to the right. Oh, you're just so... What the fuck? Why did he throw that? What was that? What was that animation? What the fuck did you just do? I, was, I threw that to A. It just didn't work. Loser. That was so fucking open. Oh, I need gunslinger. I need gunslinger so bad. Dude, it's wide the fuck open. Now I'm not even gonna get the fucking touchdown. I am so pissed off. Oh, I'm so pissed off. Rodgers did the weirdest. I hate Rodgers. He's just gonna throw a fucking laser here. Hey. What did you just do? You ran past the fucking... Oh, my God. He threw the ball at his face. Oh, my God. And he ran over it. What was that? Who wants to explain this one? Another drop. Oh. <laughs> you know, I have been getting really lucky my first, like, two games of the season. So, I guess it's cool that a little bit of it's catching up to me. But also, it's not cool at all. <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> okay. That is just so fucked up. You didn't even know where he was. Please. Guys, guys, he's throwing the triple coverage. Fucking pick it. Ah! Now he's running it. This is a draw. Just walked around fucking Nick Neiman's dumb ass. <laughs> oh, I am so mad. <laughs> Take your fucking win, dude. I'm so done. I can't wait to be done playing today. That's the throw that I threw in the end zone that got dropped. He's gonna drop to Waller now. And that's gonna leave this wide open. I am having a very bad day. Just take it. Take it. I fucking screwed out of my first touchdown, so now I just have to sit here and watch all this bullshit. <laughs> Dude, we can't buy an interception. He can throw any contested, ridiculous catch he wants, and it won't get picked off. So I have some absolute bullshit happen. Walter P, nice catch. Best thing I can do now is get Devonta Adams a touchdown. It's, it's really the only good thing I can do now. Oh, here we go. Out of bounds. Fuck. I would like to say what I just did there was A and then B and then A, which should have thrown that ball to Devonta Adams because I don't have Gunslinger. Rodgers can't throw the ball fast enough. So the game read the inputs of A, and then it lagged, and then A, which is why I threw it to Darren Waller. I can't even get my touchdown with Devonta Adams right. It would actually be hilarious if he sold this game though. I think his luck is finally running out here at the end of the fourth quarter. Middle high low. Kadarius Tony would very much like a Devonte Adams touchdown. Oh,
Dumb pass. Dumb pass. I just wanted my Devontae Adams touchdown, bro. He's on the one, though. If I score and get a two point, it's fucking tied. Have you seen a man choke a 17 0 lead? No way, this is really possible, bro. No answer. Dude, Canarius Tony actually burnt his man. But I actually like this better. Because I can ensure that I get out of bounds like that, and it's a lot safe. Can't. Oh, lucky ass animation right there. There he is. Are you not in? It's 15 to 17, ladies and gentlemen. Let's see if he goes five wide. I think DK Metcalf burns his man here. He got him. Oh no, he did it! Richard Sherman, damn. And DK Metcalf's walking his own ass out of bounds. Dude, can't even try and make the tackle. Yeah, it didn't really matter. That game fucking screwed me from the start. That has to be the most frustrating game I've ever played in Madden. That guy sucked. Look at this, dude. It's the final play of the game. I'm staying low with the linebackers. I turn right then and there. Perfect defense. No animation. Look at that. I'm in front of him. You gotta step on him. Just reach your fucking arms out. So watch this bag, though. This would have sent us to OT. Nothing was open. Yeah, there's nothing open here. Although I did have time to make a decision, a better decision with Rodgers. Jonathan Taylor could have been the throw. Right there, throw Jonathan Taylor. Probably could have laid down with it. And I don't have Gunslinger, so he throws that ball so slow it gets picked off. Gunslinger is very important. Well, that makes us three and one, and we don't get to keep any of the players from today, but that's okay. I'm, I'm too frustrated to care. Like I said, I was getting so lucky at the start that I guess I was due some fucking nonsense to happen and it's a pretty good example right there just gotta put all my bums back in now